flipping houses for beginners the true cost of flipping houses for beginners let's talk about that <laughs> all right what's going on let's talk about the true cost of flipping houses for beginners uh there's a lot of discrepancies and a lot of uh, doubts around this you know because honestly a lot of gurus are selling the idea that you can start flipping houses with no money okay but let's put things in context right let's put things in context really quickly because uh i think um uh, i i think honestly uh most people that are gonna win in this game they don't take an offense to somebody selling you on the idea that you can flip houses with no money with no money down right uh, you don't take an offense to that as a matter of fact you're looking for ways to justify it and people that will never do well in this business they're looking for a way to discount anything or any kind of belief system uh, that actually encourages people to win at this game right so I, I see a lot of like but it's not true that is you, you still have to put something that you spend money okay so the true cost let's talk about the true cost okay we're not talking about no money or no money down because the truth is that you can flip houses with no money down that's just a fact of the matter there's a difference between you spending money and the actual true cost now when you talk about true cost then we have to talk about everything um within any kind of context is there a cost to you learning how to flip houses yes of course okay let's start with your time right um maybe the gurus have painted this business as some something easy for you uh that's relative for the most part anything that's worthwhile in life easy or difficult are just simply not relevant because if you care about the kind of result and you value the results that's that we're talking about you don't care if there's um you don't, you don't really care if uh, if there's serious result or not you just you just you're sold on the result and that result would literally change your life so whatever it takes is what you're looking at that would be your outlook on the situation but i get it some people are like that and they need to um you know they come in the game and a few of them the anomalies will still win okay uh, eventually when they figure it out but they would waste time but most of them will never make money if you come into this game looking for all the different ways that you can uh create this belief right or, or or create doubt of any type right um when i when i first started in the in the game of wholesaling by the way which is the heart and science of finding deeply discounted house locking them up under contract and flipping those houses to uh to end end cash buyer for a fee for assignment fee right uh, it's a lucrative business that's what wholesaling is about when i first stumbled into it um you know the first course i purchased is not exactly what helped me okay in fact the only one thing i got out of it was to join the local real estate uh investors association the, the local VA. that's the only good thing i got out of the first course and i paid three thousand dollars for that course right but i'm still here 15 years later having a conversation about this so it paid off okay uh eventually now why am i saying that to you the truth of the matter is that you have to um i was instead of looking for ways that that i could tell myself that this doesn't work i i was busy looking for ways to make it work okay so when somebody tells me but it's not truly that you don't put any money down I'm like why are you bothering arguing about that okay it is very true that you don't have to put any money down like a dime to lock up a property under contract in a way that you can actually assign it and make money okay legally okay we're not talking about the contract was binding or not it became binding because you actually closed the deal okay there is no contract that was ever perfect in all of these years for me something had to be adjusted at closing or something that some kind of addendum had to be adjusted anyway all right but the key thing there is that I had never, I've never had to put down anything, anything down for down payment precisely. Did I have to pay for course to learn how to do this game? Yes. Did I have to pay for marketing? Yes. How much money are we talking about? What is the true cost here? It depends on what route or what path you decide to take. 
I just did a video re recently on the best courses, which are basic courses that I created, in my opinion, outside of the courses that I took 15 years ago, right? And there are courses that cost you nothing, <laughs> okay? So it, 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 it comes down to what are your desires? What do you want to accomplish? How bad do you want it? That's ultimately really what it comes down to, right? The true cost is mostly the time involved, the learning curve, right? You're gonna be learning a new skill set. Depending on where you're coming from in life, sometimes that takes time, and time is worth more than money. So I cannot put a true cost on it in the grand scheme of this conversation, right? I can't really put a true cost on it, but I can tell you that by the time you're spending uh, by the time you spend five thousand dollars right on courses unless you're just on serious and you don't take anything you don't implement all the way till you see results which there are many people like that most people are actually like that I'm sorry to say right but that's just the honest honestly the true numbers most people don't see all the way through to the end of what they start even when they pay thousands thousands of, of thousands of dollars for it okay I've had people pay five thousand uh, dollars for a course and didn't show up for the training all right uh, there are people like that okay so uh, now with that being said I, I just wanted to make it clear to you that the true cost is it's completely up to you you could pay zero dollars if you're serious enough and you can be disciplined enough and you can hold yourself accountable you can absolutely make a lot of things happen you can pull some real stunts out here in this game and, and make it happen. But even at that, you need tools, right? You need tools to do property data research and things like that. So the, the, the real true cost, if you want to talk about dollar amount, I'll say maybe $97 per month, another $200 per, per month, right? You can run this business. You can get this business money, okay? It's a marketing game. That's what it is. We're looking for deals. You set up campaigns to find deals, okay? Now, the step-by-step -step is something that we cover in our training or in different five steps, right? You have to see those five steps right there. But it's absolutely doable. You can do this and you can do it enough that you can actually do it in your sleep. So the question is that are you willing to go through the process of immersing yourself in the training that you need we got programs 11 days challenge that you just get through everything in 11 days and now it's a matter of consistency and showing up and doing what you're supposed to do all right so just wanted to share that with you the true cost is honestly is in time and the learning curve for the most part the dollar amount i don't care if you spend fifteen thousand dollars on training yourself if you do a couple of deals that paid for itself so I don't know if there's a real true cost in dollars when you think of it that way, right? Because it's basically an investment that will pay for itself. This is you investing in yourself, okay? And on top of that, we have all types of free resources, a free two books right there that covers everything. We have free courses. We have courses where you can add on coaching so you can pay for my time if my personal time is involved, right? And we have all those kind of resources to get you going but the true cost like i said is time and learning curve and everyone has to pay their dues i don't know what to tell you <laughs> everyone has to pay their dues <laughs>